My name's Craig Parks. I'm a sergeant and I'm the team leader of the dog team here in Canberra. I've worked um, for the past three years as the team leader of the uh, SRS dog team and I'm uh, a handler of a, uh, a bomb dog and a general purpose police dog. As a, uh, a member of the dog team, um, we mainly focused at helping uh, ACT policing. We do uh, work with uh, the tactical response team. Our dogs are trained to uh, uh, track people, uh, find people through um, building searches, area searches. I have a bomb dog which is used for uh, explosive detection, usually associated with um, VIP visits to the, to the Canberra region. There's never a day that's the same when you're working with, uh, with animals, with uh, police dogs certainly. I mean the dogs that we get, they're um, what you call high drive animals. They're dogs that uh, are very confident, uh, very strong willed, so it's quite a challenge. The, the job is a very rewarding job. Most of the time we're on our own, us and our dog, uh, so it requires someone that's uh, very self-motivated and uh, an active person because to get the best out of the animal um, you need someone that's enthusiastic and, and active and to keep the, the job interesting for the, for the dog it, it requires that enthusiasm. A normal day there's a, a degree of training, you're always doing some training with the dog and you're always listening to the radio to go to any um, a job in the community that requires a search. The training involved is quite intensive. When someone first comes to the area, it would take about 10 or 14 weeks of training every single day. I take pride in, in uh, being able to identify with the community and the community being able to identify with me as a representative of ACT policing.